successful in a KWWO follow-up. A dog owner is reunited with her puppy a day after he was stolen from her home. This is Tyson. He is a six-month-old pit bull puppy. On Monday afternoon, he was taken from his front yard in Cedar Rapids and was soon sold to a woman who police say bought Tyson from two men outside of an area McDonald's restaurant. KWWL's Jalen Socek first brought you this story last night, and tonight she is speaking again with Tyson's owner after the happy reunion. Jalen. Well, Abby, it wasn't necessarily the heavily shared posts on social media by Tyson's owners that led to finding him, though they were still out actively searching for him. Instead, the reunion came with a little luck. Destiny Stucker is feeling a whole lot better than she did 24 hours ago. Instead, she's overwhelmingly happy. Finding her puppy Tyson a day after he was stolen from her front yard. They had been sniffing out clues all day, but finding him was pure luck. It was uh, like a miracle, you know, just a chance miracle that we seen him. She was driving home just a few blocks away from where she lives when she saw a woman with Tyson. I just got out of the car and ran up the sidewalk and it was Tyson. He tried to run to me, but the girl wouldn't let him come. And I'm like, excuse me, ma'am, that's my dog. But the woman refusing to give him up, telling her she had bought him the day before for $150. I took a hold of him. She was holding on to him, you know, kind of, I'm not letting go of my dog. 911 was called and officers determining that it was Tyson. I cried. <laughs> I just cried. I was so happy. You know, I was one of my dog. Tyson now appearing very happy to be back home. His sister, Sadie, too. But the ordeal isn't lost on Destiny, who says she's afraid to let her dogs back outside. I don't want it to happen again. I don't want it to happen to somebody else's dogs either. You know, they're still out there. Just because I got my dog back and I'm happy about that, don't get me wrong, doesn't mean it's not going to happen to somebody else. Cedar Rapids police tell me they're currently inv investigating, but say there will be no charges brought against the woman who bought Tyson. Live in Cedar Rapids, Jalen Socek, News 7, KWWL. All right, Jalen, thank you very much. A good end there. Now, please also tell us that the owners used part of the $500 reward money that they were offering to pay back the woman who bought Tyson.